the story behind this collection is one of those extraordinary tales. Um, it, uh, the works all belong to Ambroise Vollard, the legendary Parisian art dealer. And uh, in 1939, he died shortly before the outbreak of the war. And a few months later, the work somehow ended up in the hands of a young Yugoslav called Eric Shlomovich, who Vola had met during the last few months of his life. Uh, when war broke out in Paris, Shlomovich had to flee. And he deposited this group of around 140, 150 works in a safe in the Société Générale. He fled Paris, he fell under the Nazis, uh, died in 1942, and the collection remained undiscovered and unknown for some 40 years. One of the treasures in this collection is a, is a small, exquisite portrait of Émile Zola by Paul Cézanne. Uh, it's extremely rare and it's a wonderful insight in a way into their intense relationship, literary, artistic relationship, friendship. Um, and so it's, a, it's not only a document of that time and that uh, 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 friendship, um, but also a very rare museum quality work by Cezanne, estimated at five to 700,000 euros. Oh, it's fantastic to have it because Vollard is such an important dealer. You know, he was Picasso's first dealer. He gave Picasso his first show in his own uh, house, I think. Um, and he was enormously influential. To find this enormous trove of works is, is amazing. There's this fantastic painting, the uh, Fauvis de Rhin, which will certainly uh, do extremely well. But it's not only that, you've got these touching works that you can see around me. Um, the prints that were made uh, from Renoir, Picasso, and so it's, it's really, it's a very exciting rediscovery. I think that a collection of this importance is going to attract a whole range of international buyers. For the Dura, this is one of the great Fauve masterpieces, and we expect interest from around the world, from Asia, from Russia, from all around Europe, from America, the Middle East. Um, but this is only part of the collection. There are a further group of drawings and prints um, and books. Um, and paintings that will be sold in Paris with estimates ranging from just a thousand euros to 500,000 euros. And these are really for connoisseur collectors and for a range of people passionate about the artists represented in the collection.